All right. Uh, thanks, Andy. A fantastic event. Uh, oh, it's not there anymore. Uh, Psycon US. Uh, I had a chance to go there in last November. A great conference. And uh, Andy, sorry for the rough sequencing here. Uh, honestly, it wasn't intentional. Please don't do it to me. And, you know, <laughs> at, at, le at least pr pr let me know beforehand. But uh, yeah. Um, well, um, I had some notes, but um, those of those of you who know uh, 80s movies well, you you know that after after the silly comes uh, ridiculous, totally ridiculous, and then there is only only one speed left. That's uh, that's ludicrous. Uh, Spaceballs, I haven't seen it. <laughs> yeah, okay, there's some. Uh, so I was I was afraid if Andy kicks in ludicrous, well, I got nothing left. But no, no, it's it's all mine, so I got to do it. Uh, wow, uh, what a what a conference, what a psychon. Uh, now, um, I know that uh, the last speaker has the expectation of summarize what's been said. So last night, after you uh, left the party, I started reading. Um, yeah, uh, and uh, I, I must have a misprint copy because I got to the end, there was no executive summary. It wasn't there, so uh, you all got this thing. Um, but uh, I think I'm going to go with the president's summary, uh, knowing her uh, work ethics and, and ca capacity. She probably read it before coming here. So uh, what she said on Wednesday pretty much sums it up. Uh, it's not a direct quote now, but I'm incorporating it into, into my, my thoughts that the four days of workshops, keynotes, panels, and then the side discussions at the coffee breaks, at the icebreaker, uh, on the beach last night, uh, perhaps someplace after the beach. I don't even know, because I was reading the book. Um, it, there was some battle in there. It definitely was not silent. That's what the president said, right? Don't be silent on cyber. So uh, that's the summary. Now, uh, wow, uh, you, the audience, we, we do psychons because of you and for you. Uh, it's, it's so cool to see that there is so many of you here still. Uh, it's, it's the last day. Uh, last night on a speech uh, that nobody could hear because of sound, uh, I was making parallels with Marathon. Uh, I used to run them before I had kids, so I ran my last one uh, five years and, and seven months ago, one month before my son was born. Uh, so uh, I, I said in my speech last night that, you know, if you go to Marathon and you stop at 35K, because there is a cool drinking station and, you know, people to talk to and you don't go to the finish, then uh, you haven't really been there or done it. So uh, you are now on a final stretch, uh, 42K is done, uh, all the rest, 198 meters, that's me. So you're, you're almost there, congratulations. And uh, thank you for being here once again, you the speakers. Uh, when I, when I came to this job nine months ago, uh, I was told about the call for papers process, and I thought it was too rigorous, too, too rough. Um, uh, but I decided in my first year I'm not going to change the big things, the, the big traditions, and now I've learned that the, this, is, this is the thing that sets Psycon apart. Uh, in my nine months, I've been avoiding traveling as much as I can, but uh, I've still been to a few conferences, and. Uh, I need to be careful with the words now because I was I was really positively cyber tamed by by Jessica and by Luke here. But uh, in my, the last my nine months, the, the word cyber tainer had a negative context to me because uh, I've, uh, I've seen people that go from conference to conference and just fairly unprepared go do their thing and then go next. And I don't know if they if they sometimes have a job. Uh, you all, the, you all the speakers at SciCon, uh, the keynotes, the panelists, uh, the moderators, you come well prepared. Uh, that's, uh, that's been amazing uh, to, to witness here in the last four days. Well, uh, I definitely need to thank the volunteers. Uh, there is about a dozen of them. Uh, they, uh, I don't know if they could all come to this room or not, but you've seen them in white, white shirts. They, they've been... Uh, helping you all this week. We couldn't do it without them. They've taken a full week off their, uh, off their work, their schedules, and come here to help us. So uh, uh, wonderful. Uh, I know we pay you guys, the, the sound and audio guys, but uh, you've done such a tremendous job. So, so thank you. Uh, amazing. Really good. And uh, 
Then uh, I'm coming to the people who have been bringing you the uh, previous 10 icons and this one. This one. So currently we have 60 people working on the CCDCOE, and I want to thank uh, all the 59 of them who worked really hard and delivering you this this icon. Amazing, but it it, uh, it they've been you know you haven't seen most of them. Uh, you have seen Billerin and Henrik here. Uh, but uh, some of the stage managers, the, the logistical people support uh, the, the uh, program committee. You don't even know who they are, uh, probably. So uh, it's been a true team effort. But we're building on a legacy of 10 previous Psycons. So I want to thank all the previous directors and their teams. I've seen everyone besides Ilmar here this week. I don't know if they're all here. Um, but uh, and I want to count Raul in there as well, even though officially he wasn't the director, but but still Raul Rick. So so Raul, Ilmar, Arthur, Sven, Merle, thank you so much for for your efforts and your team efforts, your team's efforts that you did through, uh, through the last uh, ten years. I want to thank our sponsors. Uh, that was great entertainment. Look, that was that was good. Uh, we, as I said on Wednesday, we couldn't do this without without the sponsors. Uh, being, being a governmental organization, non-commercial non conference. Then there is only one thing left, and uh, that would be the theme for the next year's conference. There is a tradition, it's announced uh, as the last thing. Uh, the tradition is also that it's uh, short, uh, vague enough to provide generic guidance, but uh, not to restrict us from talking Next year, the hot issues that we might not even be aware of today as we thought of the theme. So the theme for Psycon 2020 is 2020 vision, the next decade. Now, I suppose you could have this theme any year. We decided to have it next year for some reasons. Uh, uh, I know now that the, the uh, recommendation came from a European staff member, but I know now the audience is split. The Americans know exactly what 2020 vision means, and the Europeans might not. Uh, let me try to explain. If, if your eyes are like mine, that um, Wednesday, you know, you didn't know to properly remove your stage makeup and went to bed, uh, and your eyes have been watery and then kind of blurry last two days, you, you don't see it, then you don't have 2020 vision, that 2020 means perfect vision in, in American medical terms. Now, to go into real definition, what that, what's there behind the numbers, it's kind of, it's as deep as answering the 20th century profound philosophical con um, question, uh, what do they call a quarter pounder with cheese in Europe? No one laughed. It's a young crowd. Because I, I, I was, I was, I was going to say that if you laugh to that, you're revealed you're more than 45 years old. But uh, yeah, it's 80s classic. No, that's 90s classic music, uh, classic movies. Now, we got the theme. We've done Psycon. We've been entertained. Uh, this is it. We, we're done. Uh, next is lunch. Have a safe trip back home. Uh, Thank you for coming this year. See you in DC in November and back here in May. Bring your perfect vision. The Psycon is closed.